In Harris County, approximately 150 children are injured or killed by guns every year, and that number is quickly rising in our city. 40% of homes in Texas contain firearms. As a community, our goal is to ensure that our children stay safe by doing one simple thing, safely storing our firearms. The cases I dread the most are those in which children are injured or injure others with guns, especially from accidental shootings or suicides. Our research has shown that in almost a third of these cases, tragedies like these could have been avoided by safely storing guns in homes. It's our responsibility as adults to safely store our firearms. Because one slip up, one unplanned moment, can lead to unspeakable tragedy. My 14-year-old daughter, Adrienne, was shot and killed by my best friend's 14-year-old son after he left a loaded gun on their kitchen table. Her death has affected so many people's lives forever. The boy who fired the gun had extensive gun safety training, but that training didn't prevent what happened because children can make mistakes. I am still a gun owner even after our tragedy, and I passionately believe that teaching gun safety to children and most importantly, responsibly storing our firearms is crucial to protect our children and any visiting children when they come into our homes. As Americans, owning a firearm is a right, but rights come with responsibilities. There are many different options to safely store your firearms. Biometric safes allow for quick access to a firearm only by those authorized to use it. You also have the options of using a lockbox or a cable lock, which can be used on any type of firearm. These cable locks are provided for free by law enforcement. You can request one at your local police department or at the Harris County District Attorney's Office at no cost, no questions asked. When a child is hit by a bullet, that single moment sends an aftershock into the community. The damage goes well beyond the statistics. The good news is, this isn't a random problem. It's something we can help prevent. As gun owners, we must be aware that within our homes, there could be a device that is the difference between life and death for a depressed teenager. In fact, the risk of suicide in teenagers can increase up to 10 times in homes with accessible guns. Other adults in the home with suicidal thoughts, PTSD, or dementia are also at great risk. As a pediatrician, as a trauma surgeon, as a police officer and a father, as your district attorney and a mother, as a gun owner and a parent. Lock up your guns. And save a life.